I recently found out that London has actual farms with farm animals and apparently we can actually be among these animals so that's what we are going to do first place we're going to is the kentish town farm oh sorry no dogs yo i can't take you i love animals and i've always felt calm being among them recently i haven't felt very calm so i spent my time looking for a way to sneak huh? inside the london zoo Bruh. but then i came across london farm i couldn't believe it there were farms inside london and i just assumed they were in the outskirts so we're just allowed inside. Oh my god, Barke, it's your brother. Look at the size of that. Oh my god, Barke, it's calling your name. You know we have a pet pig in, uh, in the Philippines. You eat what? Yeah, I actually rolled it and then we what ate you, it. What are you talking about? We have pet pigs in the Philippines. You had a pet pig? Yeah. What, was his name Jake? His name was Barke. All right. And that's before I even knew. All right. What is that? Quail, barrel. Cornelius. <laughs> oh my days, look at the chicken. Look at all my days. It's very curious about the camera. Barke, there's cows in there, you know? They are not cows. There's there. cows in there. Are we allowed in there? I don't know, but it smells amazing. Oh my God, that is huge. Imagine how many cheeseburgers you can get from that. My bet, over 1,300. What do you think about like, actually like working in the farms? I don't mind. Oh, Barke, let's do a picture of Barke. No. I'm not joking, bro. Nah, you can be the down one. Yeah, I like you. Nah, you're getting nah, down here. Fuck it up. It smells so good. I regret my life choices right now. I think this is made for kids. Did you get that again, bro? <laughs> oh, fuck. Bro, they have goats. They have goats. <laughs> hey, Broski, what's your snap a chat, though? Broski, what's your snap? I was good, Shadi. Let me read you a Bible verse real quick. The Lord is gracious and compassionate, <laughs> slow to anger and rich in love. <laughs> you yeah, feel me now? Yo, come on. They probably have horses. Honestly, I think everyone should be among animals every now and then. Temporarily being away from buildings and city lights is good for you. Plus, you get to smell the amazing farm smells. Oh my days, that's a donkey. Jake, your brother, Shrek. What the fuck? What the hell? They don't have the horse, apparently. I like the goat and I like the chicken. I was expecting horses here. Oh, no, this, this farm was whack. So that was the Kentish Town City Farms. The I was tired. What'd you say? I was tired. The animals weren't really alive. Uh, the only thing that was good about it for me personally was the piano. Which was out of tune. I'd give it a solid 4 out of 10. I'd give it a 5 because the goats were cool. I'd give it a 3 now because oh. you've rated it higher. Okay. <laughs> On to the next farm. The next place is Spitalfield City Farm. Alright, so we're here. This is uh, the actual entrance. Dragons in the city. What does that mean? Donkeys, sheep, goats and pigs are that way. Bees, bug hotel, rabbit, duck pond and farmyard. Which I'd way? say we go left first and then right because there's less in the left and there's more to the right. When it comes to a fight, there's less to the site. But I'm not a rapper. I'm confused. Where are the animals? Oh, oh, oh. Right over there. Compose yourself. Oh, my days. But it's a giraffe. Don't get too close, though. It might eat the camera. Can you do a backflip? Give me 10 quid, I'll touch it right now. Is that the only one? Bro, imagine it just like, like a llama, it just spits after seeing you. Come on, these farms are so tight. Another donkey. How do you call a donkey? Yo, call your brother. I know what to do. Touch up, baby donkey crying, and they'll react. I did that with my hamster. He was, he was bugging out. <laughs> donkey mating cool. Oh, fight, fight. Oh, shit. Oh, ja, 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 ja. These are the deadest donkeys I have ever seen. Let's get the hell out of here. Why are the sheep and the goat? Oh, there's a bug hotel. Nah, 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 nah. Why are you scared? I'm not going there. This guy's a pussy hole. What am I looking at? Bees, apparently. Oh, fuck that. Another reason why I wanted to do this was because of how expensive it is getting to film in London. I mean, take the London Zoo, for example. Per person is like 25 to 30 pounds just to see those animals. I just did that for free. Oh, I I remember these. Do you, do you have any court cash from you? I don't. Yeah, do you have that one? You man are disappointments for real. There's the only reason I came here, bro. Oh. No way. Give me it. I haven't done this in so long. What the <laughs> fuck? Do you have another one? Nope, that was it. Oh my lord, that was tired. There's a ferret. Oh my days. I've wanted ferrets ever since I watched Avatar. You know, Legends of Korra. This guy's a nerd. <laughs> my man's got earrings on. Fuck it, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god. This guy's a menace. Why is he so happy? Oh fuck, the main guy's about to pull out. Oh, look at that. Fuck that. That guy looks like an alpha male fan. Oh fuck no. No, 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 no. Chill, 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 chill. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. As soon as this motherfucker walked out, everyone else walked inside. Everyone but that little mini guy. Oh, look what he's doing. Everyone's scared of him. What? What should I name him? JR, what should I name him? Jimmy. Uh, this is Jimmy the goat. Jimmy is probably the nicest goat in the whole area. Review time. So, we just finished touring the whole spital, spittle field. What do you think? It was that high. That wasn't was much, to be honest. That wasn't much. For a farm, I'd give it a seven out of 10. It's a free farm. We got to see pigs, sheep, donkeys, ferret. What do you give it? I think this is like the nicest farm we've been to so far. In my opinion, humble seven. 
copied my answer. What? On to the next one. Okay, so we are at Mud Sheep Farm. Finally, after fucking traveling forever. What is this place? Where are the animals? I'm confused. I thought I came to a farm. Bro, Ski, I have not seen one entity. What's this? All my days. Look at the fucking size of them. It's fucking huge, mate. I think there are more animals in the back. This is the biggest farm. Yeah, I think. These are geese, not geese. You know, they're all females. That's why they're inside. Because look at that one horny male. Oh, nah, he's onto it, bro. <gasps> they are nervous. Bro's getting a bit too excited. That's a giraffe, bro. Fuck it, get close. Yeah, so it spits on my face. Say that. Yeah, go closer, please. Oh my god, now nah, he's ready. He's ready. <laughs> look at them. <laughs> Broski, let's go to civilization. Fuck. I hope he bites. Look at these animals, bro. Bro, I like goats. Honestly, when I'm older, I wouldn't mind like owning a farm because of this shit. They're one of the most peaceful creatures. <laughs> Look at this bad man. What do you want to name him? Let's call him Chuck. Chuck. Chuck the goat. We're done with the mud shit farm. It's the biggest farm we've been to yet. Chuck the goat, begging for attention by the way, tried to eat my jacket. I'd give this one a good 8.5, maybe even 9 out of 10. If Chuck didn't eat my jacket, I would Personally, give it a 9 out of 10. I would give it a 7.5. 7.5? Why so low? Because I'm harsh like that. All right, on to the next one. So the next place is the Vauxhall City Farm. Jake left because he's a pussy. I think the entrance is down there. Um, and if you want to get some animal food to feed them. Oh, we can feed them? Yeah, yeah. there's a pound for each of the bags. Oh my days, they have baby goats. Oh, what? They have guinea pigs. I want to stay away from the alpacas because I feel like they spit at you. I feel like a kid again. <laughs> Visiting all of these farms so far has been an amazing experience for me personally. Sometimes I think we get so wrapped up in our own worlds that we forget to appreciate the finer things in life. And yes, that includes the stinky farm smell. As difficult and weird it may be, these farms with weirdly aggressive animals really calmed me and gave me a chance to laugh at things that aren't funny memes or TikTok. I'm honestly grateful to be able to make these type of videos. Oh, what, you're eating my, you're eating my fingers. Oh my days. Oh my day. Okay, this is scary. No, that's it, G, you're done for. You're done for. They, they want nothing to do with you unless you have something to offer. Yo, 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 chill. Yo, 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 yo. Bro, what is that? <laughs> oh, what, the scary one's pulling up. Hello, mother. Review time. Vauxhall City Farm. I'm at the Cow Bryony. Brioni. After seeing Brioni, I'd give this solid 7.5 out of 10. If Jake was here, I'm sure he'd agree with me. Sorry, Doc's Farm, the final place. It's so bright. It's a bit quiet, no? For like a farm? Yeah, they have horses. No, man, that's a fucking donkey. I thought those were horses at the end, the white ones. The donkeys. God damn it. If you can't tell, Bucket's favorite animal is definitely <laughs> I can't help it. Look at them, they're so peaceful. Goats love me, I don't know why. What are you saying, G? Say nothing, bro. Review time of the Surrey Dogs Farm. We got into this farm expecting the animals to be up and like, you know, just moving around, doing their thing. There weren't many animals here. Like I was expecting way more because of the size of the farm on the map. The chickens are too aggressive. The sheep were so quiet. They were so quiet. Even the boars were quiet. I think it's because it's 12 p.m. Every single farm we've been to yet, the goats, they just like get to me. Like broski, chill. Seriously, this farm is beautiful. Overall, I'd give this a 7.5. When it comes to ranking all the farms, the worst one we went to was probably Kentish Town Farm. There weren't many animals. The area itself was interesting and the animals there seemed dull. The best one was Mud Shoot Farms, without a doubt. So many animals and they were all weirdly aggressive towards my cameraman, which made the whole experience better. I'm gonna leave donation links for these farms in the description. And if you feel like helping support them, this is one way you can do it. 